This is the word, is the word of a pyro pyro Hey guys, I'm here with a brush video today. Now, let's touch on a few things before I get started. Um, I am very behind on videos, so if I'm dropping them out back to back, you guys will know why. I have to catch up because it is December and I need to get a lot of this stuff out the way. I haven't been posting videos because if you're a YouTuber, you will know since if you posted a video like December 3rd, -ish, 4th, our view count has got stuck. So no man, I don't play about my view counts and stuff, and so I don't want to post any videos, but you got to keep it pushing, right? So what I have today is brushes to show you all. Now, all of these brush sets are super inexpensive. Like I have told you guys before, to me, the brand of the brush does not matter as long as it is a good brush and it's functioning properly, if that makes sense. Basically what I'm trying to say is you can have a brush that costs $2 and as long as it's not shedding and it is doing what it needs to be doing, that's just good as a brush you're going to pay $75 for, okay? So in my opinion, the type of brush matters, not the brand. And what I mean by that is I feel like everybody needs a good blending brush, everybody needs a good small eyeshadow brush, everybody needs a good powder brush. So the type of brush you use matters, but the brand though. So what I decided to do since it's so close to Christmas was bring you guys another one of those inexpensive um, brush videos. I did one last year. I will link it below and let's just get straight to it. Okay, so I have stuff everywhere as always and it's laid back. I'm sorry. I didn't get all extra cute for y'all today, but hey, it's more about what I'm showing than how I look hopefully. So this is the first brush set right here. So keep in mind that every brush that I will be showing you will be below the direct link. Just click it and shop away. Um, often I try to put them in the order that I show them, but if I don't, the description will tell you which which set is which. Okay. So this is I want to say it's red. Is it red or is it pink to you guys? I don't know. I don't know. It's looking kind of reddish to me. But it's a great travel set. It comes with this patent leather fold snake case. And I think you can get this in other colors. And you open it up like this. And you have this set right here. So this is a 16 piece brush set. And this is what it looked like in the inside. So let me tell you what I look for in a good brush set. Like I said, it has to have a blending brush, a good eyeshadow brush, a good powder brush and a good stiff synthetic fiber brush for like packing on creams and liquids like an eye base or something. So all of the brushes I will be showing you guys today I have not played with at all. So I'm telling you to buy at your um, own risk but you know brushes are kind of like one of those things you can take a chance on. The most that can happen is it tear up or it shed easy and for the price that you pay for these brushes you'll still have a whole lot of other brushes in the set to use so it's really not a big loss now. Uh, for instance, like in this set, these three brushes right here are almost exactly the same, okay? They're all eyeshadow brushes. One looks small, medium, and large, but they all set, serve the same purpose. So, you know, like if you have one that tears along, along the line, you have the other two to use. So, basically what I do is zoom in so that you guys can see a close-up of this brush set. And as you guys can see, they look pink to me now, so I guess this is pink. And they have a little pink tip. So this is really, really cute for all of my pink lovers. It's just really, really, um, it's a fuchsia color pink. And it's a really, really cute set. All of these brushes do look synthetic, okay? And, um, yeah, that's this set right here. So it do, you can just, you can just fold it back up and snap it like that okay so next i have two more brush sets they both say real technique um i don't know what the t is on that but that's what they say okay so this is what they look like this is the core collection set and it says your base brushes and this is the travel essential sets okay i'm just opening up the core collection set so you guys can see it there are four brushes in here there are only two brushes that i would really really use on a regular and I love the Real Technique brush sets because they come with this little um, foldy thing right here. You know, um, this is really good to put pencils in too if you want to take the brushes out and put pencils in them and carry them on the go like this, okay? Eyeliner, eyeliner or lip liner pencils. So anyway, out of this set, this brush right here, which they have is the buffing brush. 
It's one of my favorites. It's good for buffing in foundation and etc. And then I also, I love this brush right here. Oh my gosh. It is called the contour brush. But what I love it for is under the eye and the contour and to apply highlighter, okay? So they have the like copper or rose gold handle. So next is the travel brush set. There are only three brushes in here. Um, let's see, you have a multi-task brush, um, a deluxe crease brush, and this one right here is an essential brush. Okay, so I don't see myself at using this first one at all. This is like that foundation brush that hardly gets used now since we have so many buffing brushes and stuff that are out now. Um, but I still, like if I'm at the shop and I have a lot of brushes that are dirty and one of these are clean, I'll use that to apply my moisturizer and etc. And this is one of my favorite brushes too. I love this brush. Okay, Okay. so apparently there's another set, set in here. It's the starter set. And it looks like this. And it just has um, eyeshadow blending brushes, liner brushes and etc. Like that. Yeah, exactly. A crease brush, base brush, pixel, eyeliner brush and everything. So this set, and they are all purple. So yeah, check that one out on the website. Next we have a seven piece brush set. And this brush set has pink handles and it look like this. Now in this brush set, I can already tell that some of them are roughly made, um, tapered and cut kind of rough. So you have to be careful with these. Sometimes you can condition them and make them a little softer, but yeah, you can always use a good liner brush. So that's what's in here. You have three different type of blending brushes might be four this might be a blending brush too and then we have like a little pencil brush and a liner brush okay so that's a seven piece brush set and they are pink i'm gonna move it to this set right here it is a 10 piece brush set now you guys might have seen these before i have another set that's just like this they are purple at the tip and purple at the handle the only difference is the this set right here is black at the handle so i'll open them up for you guys real quick and basically you have all of these sigma type dupe brushes that are good for foundation some of them are just pointed some of them are round some of them are flat and one of them is angled okay and then you have the smaller brushes over here and i do not like the cut of these at all um they are very bluntly cut and so i can't see myself using probably just this one right here but yeah, that's what this set look like right here. Okay, then I got some disposables, which a lot of you guys might not be interested in because I use them in my professional kit, but just in case you are prof uh, professional, I got the disposable lip ones. This is 100, I wanna say. And I need these super bad because I'm actually out. And I need these bad also. This is the disposable mascara ones. This is a set of 100 also. And so I just got two of those. And these are a little bit smaller than these in size. Okay, let's hop into another type of brush real quick. This is a electric facial cleanser brush. The light is really, really bright. But you guys know this is like the Clarisonic and all of that. It has two speeds and it's waterproof and you keep it in your bathroom. And you can also get this on the site for dirt cheap, way cheaper than the Clarisonic. So if you're into facial brush, brushes or you wanted to try one out and couldn't afford like the Clarisonic, I would highly recommend trying one of these first. And, um, you know, just try to see if you like it before you splurge or you might just like this one and feel like this is sufficient. So check this out. I will leave the link below. Okay, if you're someone like me and you don't like using like those pink and green and orange and purple brushes in your kit, Here's another seven piece brush set. It's just like the pink one. It's the exact same thing as this pink set that I showed you guys earlier, except the handles are black. So it's the same exact brushes in here. The color is just different. So I would never put like this type of pink brushes in my kit. So it's good to know that you can get it in black off. So this will have to be one of my favorite brush sets that I was sent. It's a 15 piece and the handles, the handles are yellow on this brush set. Um, but I'm quite sure this one came in other colors. Um, I think it came in blue, I want to say, but the handles are yellow now. Quality-wise, this is one of the best sets I was sent. You get 15 brushes, and oh my gosh, like this brush right here is heaven to me. It's perfect to add that highlighter on or to get up under the eye with some powder. Then you have a bigger brush like this. They're kind of like tulip shaped. Um, you get a powder brush, and let me see what else in here. Look at this good stippling brush. 
And what else? There was one more in here I was highly impressed with. This one right here is like a chubby shadow brush. And this is good under the eye also. And I love it when you get a brush set and the lip brush um, separates. Let me see if I can do it. Yeah, it separates because if you have lipstick on this, you don't want it to get all over your kit. So you just slide it back in here so you can wash it good so that your lipstick won't get everywhere, okay? So yeah, I highly recommend this brush set and I will leave it below. Ugh. Okay, then I got two of those brush in a cup concepts. You guys know I love these for travel. Beginner brushes, you open the cup when the brushes are dirty, you put the dirty brushes on one side, the clean on another one. In my traveling kit, I used to have eyeliner pencils in here. And so, yeah, this one looks very familiar. It looks just like the BH Pop Art set. I think that's the name of it. I'm not sure if it got the same brushes in it. And I don't feel like going out to get my um, other ones, but all of the brushes are just different colors and it's just real cute. These are short travel handle brushes. They are not full size brushes. So keep that in mind. So that's what's in that first set. And this is like a bronzy copper like set. And the brushes in here are also travel size and they have like a gold hint to them. And yeah, they all are um, synthetic fiber, like dual fiber type brushes. So that's what coming in that set right there. And you also get another one of those lip brushes that I was just talking about, but this looks more like a liner brush that comes um, in a little container like that. So that's how both of the sets look open. And then you have the other little cup over here that you snap on or leave, or you can put brushes on each side. Then we have a 24 piece brush set. This one is in blue. You open it like this and you have 24 brushes. Now this is one of my favorites also. This is like mm, half and half because like all of these over here, I would not find a use for them, but then you get over here and they are banging. The quality is good, full size, full handle brushes. You get a big fan brush and you also get a smaller one right here. You get quite a bit of good brushes in here, synthetic fiber brushes. So I love, 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 love the quality of this set, especially compared to some of the other ones that I showed. So yeah, like always, I'll leave the link below. And while Bay is over here helping me take the wrapper off my last brush set, let me show you three things that I got that you know that's not brushes i just had to sneak them on in and i should not have and that's what i get because i snuck in like two of these fall hats and i don't know i keep ordering these and i keep sending these little old bitty hats i don't know why so if you have a daughter or something those will be cute i will leave the link below and then i also got this i love 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 beanies in the winter just put them on and it just has a little cute furry Thing at the top and it's red and this came in black white and a whole bunch of other things so let me show you guys the last brush set last we have this 32 piece brush set that come like this i see this brush a lot on a lot of sites all of these brushes with the like wood handle 32 brushes like i said bittersweet out of these 32 is probably like 15 of them that i probably would trash personally um i wouldn't have a use for them or they there are just multiples of each other, but it's still a good set. Like I said, it has the um, big fan brush, a little fan brush. It has like two of these spongy things that come in like makeup palettes, like little stuff like that is unnecessary to me. But you guys might find a good use for it, so I will leave this link below. And that's all of the brushes. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead and get to ordering because this is Chinese based, so if you want it before Christmas, I will order it now, okay? If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments. Thanks for watching.